Hello everyone, this is the Guitar Viking Al. Today I would like to introduce you to Tokyo's Guitar Mecca. Tokyo is one of the city that you can find amazing guitars. And there's this place called Ochano Mizu in Tokyo, which is uh, maybe a few stations away from Tokyo Station. Um, there's this place called Ochano Mizu that there is a golden street of guitar shops. The whole street is almost guitar shops. So I call that the Mecca of guitar. So we should go and check it out and see how it is like uh, and uh, maybe you might find some amazing guitars so i hope you're gonna enjoy this tour let's go and check it out Here we are at Ochano Mizu Station. Make sure you get off at Ochano Mizubashi exit. And to today's uh, menu is this. Tokyo's Guitar Mecca. Spot 1, ESP Kingdom. Spot 2, Electric Guitar Heaven. Spot 3, Ibanez. Spot 4, the legend since 1937. Spot 5, amazing second hand shop. Spot 6, looking for boutique pedals. Spot 7, the wall of Zephyrus. Spot 8, lefty's paradise. Spot 9, Gibson and Fender, custom and vintage. Spot 10, castle of Gibson. Alright, let's walk across the street. Here you go. Doom, 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 doom. I am so excited! I'm so excited, excited! Alright, here. The first place we see is ESP Big Boss. It's just like one minute away from the station. This is the biggest ESP shop globally. I, I'm sure you know about ESP. ESP is like one of the biggest, famous uh, high-end Japan guitar uh, maker. All right, well, we are in ESP Big Boss. Um, you'll see a lot of guitars hanging already. And uh, just to let you know, um, this shop. Um, if you ask the staff, uh, there are stuff that can support you in English. So it's really good. So um, if you need uh, help, um, this is an ESP guy. It's really, really friendly and nice. They are willing to support you all the time. And here, um, look at this collection of the effector pedals. It's like a wall. You know, you you almost be able to find um, any effector pedal here uh, at uh, Big Boss. All right, let's uh, go to the second floor. The second floor, um, you'll be able to see uh, more high-end guitars. All right, here we go. Uh, let's see what we got. Oh, look at that. Those are Zematis, I believe. Yeah. What's that? Uh, LTD? Is that LTD? Uh, looks like a nice, nice paint job. And here, oh, Paul, Le Paul Reed Smith. Oh, look at those 
look at those materials so wood this wood materials um, are displayed on the second floor uh, there is a corner um, where you can uh, order your original guitar um, when I visited I, I found somebody already um, discussing with the ESC, ESP staff uh, on his uh, new guitar um, so any material you can choose there's like nice uh, curly maple uh, tiger stripe maple is just amazing and look at this fender stratocaster wow you could buy a brand new car oh wow it's look at that that is beautiful and here it's all about parts um, you want to get a new part uh, you want to exchange parts uh, get it here and this is uh, the famous Japanese guitar player Akira Takasaki's collection this is from the second floor looking down the first floor you see all the um, ESP and those posters hanged up in the wall it's pretty cool all right now we are across the street uh, from the big bus and uh, this is uh, full of uh, music shops here too so this is like a caustic music uh, a caustic guitar shop here's a map this is where we are this looks like a second hand guitar shop mm -hmm. check out some second hand guitars looks good Mm -hmm. Wow, you're gonna spend like a whole day in this Ocha no Mizu if you love guitars. Yeah, I, I kind of think one day might not be enough. Alright, so uh, they do sell like keyboards in this shop here, Kurosawa. Um, here. This, this shop, you, you need to check it out. Like the whole building is all about guitars. Oh, Brian May model. All right, let's go and check it out. Good, good. Look at that, wow. By the way, um, I did ask uh, if I can film uh, the shop. Um, most of the shop, they, um, if you ask if uh, you're okay to film it, um, they usually say yes, don't worry about it, you, know, you can film if you want, um, if you need support, um, let us know. Um, most, of, most of the shoppers are, are, are super friendly and nice. There you go. Wow, look at that. These are all fenders. Is it fender? It looks like fender to me. Oh, no. It's a. Uh, it looks like Fender, but it's not Fender. This is all about Gretsch. Look at that collection! Wow, there's there's this literally no space. There's no space at all. There's like, oh my God, there's no space. It's all packed with nice guitars. Isn't that amazing? Isn't that amazing? All right. So here is a floor full of beautiful bass. Look at that! Wow. All right. Now we're in the floor of Telecaster. No, no. This is the floor of Fender. Uh, um, the whole floor is all about Fender. Wow. Look at that. Look at that. These must be like the vintage or Fender Custom. It's a super, super expensive. Wow. All right. Yeah, so that was a Fender floor. We're moving to the third floor now, which is a Gibson. Fourth floor is metal. Fifth floor is accessories. And sixth floor is effector. So we're going to the third floor, which is a Gibson's floor. Look at that. Oh, man. You like Gibson? Wow, this is like eye candy. Amazing. Look at that. Wow, such a beautiful guitar here. Look at that. Wow. 
you know um, if you're looking for a guitar um, yeah definitely you're gonna check this place if you're looking for guitar uh, Gibson Wow look at that collection of guitar Wow amazing you know um, it's just it's just fun looking at it and you know you see all kinds of beautiful beautiful Gibson Les Paul you know um, if you love Les Paul it's just, it's just amazing just looking at it there you go so this is how it looks like uh, in the third floor uh -huh, SG oh they do have uh, Paul Lee Smith not only Gibson they do have Paul Lee Smith um, all right and other high-end guitars as well like Zamatis okay here this must be the fourth floor the heavy metal area oh look at that so you'll see all kinds of guitars heavy metal guitars Ibanez and stuff Jackson this is Ibanez oh wow look at that uh, Killer Akira Takasaki model mm, ESPs looks nice Wow, it's amazing. This is like the whole wall is all guitar. <laughs> wow. Alright, so here now we're at Ishibashi Music. Ishibashi Music is uh, one of the biggest music stores in Japan. Um, they have about uh, 28 shops in Tokyo and 3 in Osaka. So uh, if you go to like a big um, city like Shibuya or um, you know um, Shinjuku Ikebukuro I think yeah you'll be able to find uh, Ishibashi because they are like everywhere in Tokyo. So let's check it out here. This is a tour of Ishibashi in Ochanomizu. Alright let's go to the second floor. Wow this, they've got like hanging guitars in the on the stairs oh look at that you know I mean like they're just like literally no space whoa <laughs> oh my god look at that all right let's go and check it out let's go in what is this is this uh this looks like this looks like a wall of Ibanez Wall of Ivan is in two layers, just like front and back. You know, so so you wanna you wanna pick that one or uh, in the back. Uh, you tell the staff as I, I I I need to get rid of the one in the front, get rid of the one inside, and then get rid of the one. Take the the one in the back. Hey, Steve Vai model. This is a new Pia. This is a new Pia. Oh wow, it's a nice guitar look at that that's such a beautiful guitar and next to it is the uh, Nuno Betancourt uh, N4 Washburn nice look at that and all of this high-end guitars all right so let's go to the next shop this is Shimokura Gaki all right Shimokura uh, Gaki is also one of the um, oldest um, music store um, I think in, in, in Japan yeah so this uh, um, Shimokura uh, instrument um, store um, has like a, a history of uh, 81 years Wow, 81 years. That's that's pretty long. All right, so uh, the first floor is uh, the guitars. 
yeah, you'll see like a collection for uh, beginners to, uh, you know, um, and you can find some high-end guitars too in the uh, basement. Um, this Shimokura uh, is really interesting. Um, the staff here, they, they all wear um, a uniform, so um, you'll be able to um, um, know like who is a staff or not. Um, in in other mute instrument shops like um, like ESP, they some staff they they look like a hard rock um, band man. So it's kind of hard to tell if they're a staff or not. So <laughs> so this is a Shimokura Second. It's just across the street. Um, you know, it's all secondhand uh, guitars, and uh, they've got like. All kinds of uh, guitars in here. It's just amazing uh, and it's fun to um, check out this place because uh, sometimes you can find a really rare guitar. Um, look at that! Uh, seems like they are um, maintaining a secondhand guitar here. So, so imagine these these staff here are, are amazing because they they are like maintaining all the secondhand used guitars and and selling it so um i kind of think that they can maintain any guitar you know just they're just so well skilled and well trained and they're so good and and look at the guitars here you know you can find it's it's like it's like a treasure hunting you know it's like it's really um fun to to uh look and find something something that you've never seen you know it's like wow i've never seen this kind of guitar it's it's cool you know um uh, so it's uh it's definitely a uh, um, place to stop by um uh, make sure um you don't miss it because this is it's it's just a fun place to to check out i i really love um checking out secondhand guitars because you know it it does have this kind of a feeling of uh, the, the history of the guitar, you know? Oh wow, look at that cracks. Oh, I love, I love uh, uh, vintage guitars, uh, Les Pauls that has cracks. It just looks so cool. Is this like, I don't know, is this like, um, is this like some people? Yeah, sometimes you want to go and buy a nice uh, um, brand new jeans, but uh, you kind of feel good and you know, um, you love your kind of um, old used, you know, um, jeans, you know, um, that has a hole. You know, that's that's kind of uh, how I feel about uh, coming and checking out the second hand guitar shop. It's it's just so fun because. Uh, you know, um, yeah, yeah, it's just, yeah, it's, it's cool. All right, this is another ESP. So it's called ESP Guitar Workshop. So this is the cool thing about this place. The collection of Boutique pedals is just amazing. You will see a lot of rare guitar pedals here. Um, what you couldn't, um, what you didn't see at uh, other shops, um, especially at uh, the ESP Big Boss, the first place we've seen. So um, definitely, if you are a pedal effect guy, you know you definitely might want to come and check out this place look at that all right so let's check out the second floor so second floor is high-end guitars plus ESP original guitars hmm. nice it, it, it just looks like an art gallery, don't you think so? This is amazing. Look at that. That is George Lynch model. 
Beautiful. Wow. Kamikaze. Now look at that artwork. That's like, it's like a piece of art. Wow. All right, so uh, the shop itself is, is not that big. It's pretty compact. But uh, yeah, there's like um, all kinds of nice guitars here. So definitely if you are a big fan of the uh, ESP, um, definitely you gotta stop by here and check out their guitars because um, this is, uh, this is ESP. Oh, look at that. Look at that paint paintwork, wow. That's amazing. It looks like the universe. All right, all right. So, hmm, nice guitars. Hmm, Schecter. What's that? All right, let's go check out the next floor, the third floor. Third floor is all about parts. All right, so um, if you're looking for something um, and you couldn't find that uh, big boss, um, maybe you'll be able to find it here because it's like the whole floor is all about guitar parts. Um, there's also a guitar uh, repair shop then, and you can see there's already a, um, a staff repairing a base. People in people in ESB um, are, are so friendly. They're like um, totally friendly, nice people. Um, they're okay filming videos if you ask them first, um, and they're really cool. So, all right. So this is Zematis. The wall of Sematis. All right. So this is called uh, Gaki Center. Let's get in. You will see the wall of Gretsch is gonna welcome you. Look at that. Wow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Look at that. Look at that. You know. Wow. Beautiful, 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 beautiful guitar. And this is the wall of Zematis. Amazing. Look at that. And the handcraft man is fixing the guitar. All right, check out the wall of Zematis. Dun, 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 dun. Oh my god. You know, I mean, like, how are you gonna get that guitar up there? I was like, hey, can I, can I uh, try out that guitar? I mean, you, you kind of need a ladder to pick that up, you know? Wow. Anyways, uh, I'm sure they, they, they have a big ladder and the uh, staff must be so skilled that they won't drop the guitar and it's just amazing all right look at that look at that Ooh, beautiful wow oh man i just love i just love um looking at all these guitars um see um all right i'm going to the second floor here is all about charvel I don't see that much Charvel um, in other shops, but uh, if you're looking for Charvel, um, this is a place you need to come. Um, I think they 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 must be like the, the Charvel dealer in, in Japan um, because uh, they got like the whole second floor for Charvel and Jackson, yeah, and Jackson too. Nice. 
Wow. Pretty much high-end guitars. Beautiful. Look at that. It's great. It looks great. So you get off Zemedes. Next is place for the lefties. This is the paradise for lefties, all right? Sorry, you get off that place. Um, it's the same building. It's called Taniguchi Gaki. Um, it's in the third floor. It's it's um, same building. You just get out from that place, uh, Zematis. Uh, you need to get in. There's like a uh, elevator that you need to go get, go out from uh, get in, get in uh, from outside and uh, press uh, third floor. Um, and uh, you will get there. There's a sign out. Uh, like a small sign outside so um, it's kind of easy to miss but uh, um, try make sure that you understand that you're, it's in the same building but you still need to get out first to, to take the elevator here you go the lefties paradise you know what um, to be honest I never uh, thought that there is a, a, a guitar shop just for lefties. You know, I, this is like my first time to see um, all kinds of guitars, all in left. You know, like so. For me, I'm I'm not a lefty, so it's just it's just so weird. You know, just like it's just so strange. You know, that the guitar that I've been looking at is is totally the shape's like totally opposite. You know, so. It's, it's so strange for me but uh, for lefties oh man I mean like you know you would you would be able to find any style of guitar um, in for left-handed users so so look at that you know um, there's like um, strap type there's like uh, Ibanez heavy metal type there's like um, Telecaster, anything. So that's, I'm sure you're gonna enjoy it. Even though you're not lefties, you gotta try it out. Check it out. All right, next is Finest Music. This, this, uh, this shop is such a nice, it's, it's, um, I kind of find it's, it's a really cozy shop. The first floor is all about Gibson. They're, uh, collection is more um, Gibson uh, custom and uh, uh, vintage collection. Um, the the staff, um, you know, um, once in a while they go to the U.S. and and order a custom um, for them, um, and then it's they just got a nice uh, guitar collection here. So uh, if you're looking for a Gibson definitely a place uh, to stop by um, here and uh, yeah it's, it's such a cozy um, place it's you know um, feels like uh, you're at a, a nice living room or something you know there's this there's this a little bit of space to to relax and watch uh, look at the guitars so when we go to the second floor it's it's all about Fender so it's a Fender custom and Fender vintage guitars. There, there are some um, um, Gibsons, but uh, yeah, you'll you'll find more uh, Fenders in here. Um, look at that Mustang. Yeah. Look at that. Those are those are those are really expensive guitars um, and you can see some vintage amps look at that mm. looks nice wow. all right this is the last one this is the last one this is the last one. This is called G Club Tokyo. Look at this. First floor, second floor, third floor, um, 
or Thor. Look at that. It's it says the whole building is Gibson. So this is like the castle of Gibson. So let's go and check it out. The castle of Gibson. So this is just the first floor of the entrance. Look at that. These are alright, these are epiphones. Epiphones in the first floor. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I guess these uh these are all epiphones here. Oh nice. Oh these are Gibsons here. These are Gibsons. Definitely Gibson. So I guess this is the second floor. Look at all the gold black Gibsons. Wow. Yeah, this is the second floor. Look at that. Oh man, look at the price. Amazing. Wow. Look at look at the materials. Look at the body, like the kilted maple, the tiger striped maple. This is amazing. Wow. This is beautiful. This is beautiful. Oh, there you go. Flying V. I love Flying V. This is so cool. Look at that. And here you go. Another Gibson. Gibson Les Pauls. And burstless pole. Wow. 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 Alright, this is a close-up. Look at that beauty. Ooh. Wow. Oh my god. Nice. That is so beautiful. Oh. I love that. I love that. I love that maple. That's amazing. Alright, seems like this is uh, the third floor. Um, Semi acoustic guitars. Look at that. Look at that. ES3C335. Mm hmm Wow, look at that. Beautiful. Beautiful guitars. Gibson ES335 TT. Hmm. Larry Carlton. Larry Carlton. Look at that. And this is so the fourth floor, which is all the acoustic guitars. Here you go. Check that out. Wow. I mean, you know, if if you love Gibson, you must check this place. Look at that Marty Friedman's uh, autograph and Gene Simmons' autograph. All right. If you go there, you gotta find. There's just all kinds of um, artists, all of it, but you gotta check that out. Hey, so that's all about it. What did you think of the, the mecca of guitar in Tokyo? The golden street of guitars. Wasn't that amazing? Oh man, I mean like, it, it's just amazing. It's just amazing looking at all these guitars and especially if you're um, going to buy a guitar and you kind of um, know what you want to buy it's just it's just gonna be fun um, to find your exact guitar um, at this mecca it's just amazing because all of that guitars is just there um, waiting for you 
So uh, even me, I, I don't, uh, you know, it's uh, I don't always buy guitars, but uh, you know, I'm, I still can enjoy um, just looking at the, at the guitars. Um, once in a while, I stop by and check out. Oh wow, this is a nice guitar. So, so um, yeah, it's uh, it's fun. It's fun just looking at guitars and talking to staff, asking about guitars and stuff. Is this is this so much of fun? Because there's so much of guitars here, there in Ochano Mizu. So, if you have any, any chance to come to Japan. Um, make sure you check out Ochano Mizu, the mecca of guitar. So, I hope you like this episode. Um, I'm gonna see you in the next episode. Uh, if you like it, please like this uh, um, video. Um, please uh, don't forget to subscribe to the video as well, the channel as well. So, thank you for watching my video. All right, so overdrive your life see you in my next video bye